All right, the gloves are on. Let's do this. Bit of a backstory, there's a new Joker movie trailer that just released recently and it looks new, it looks fresh, it looks amazing, the acting is on point. But let me just say this, okay? Let me just say this. We live in a society where people ruin everything that's good. Creating the Joker in 1989, destroy him in chemical ways. Creating the Joker now, destroy him into society. Will you people, for the love of God, just shut the fuck up? Preach! A man, preach! Society is a chemical waste. No, you! You! You're the chemical waste! Now you all see. What are you all saying? We live in a society. We live in a society where people can't spell you right. They laughed at me because I was different. I laughed at them because they were all the same. Joker. Where was this line in the trailer? And SpongeBob SquarePants? Really? I don't remember SpongeBob SquarePants being 14 years old. Indian movie, Joker. Best movie, Bollywood 2013. What? Where did that come from? I didn't understand your point. What does Bollywood have anything to do with this trailer? Moral of the movie, don't bully people or they might turn into sadistic serial killers. We're talking about moral of the movie. It's not even out yet. Okay, it's not even out yet. It's just a trailer. For God's sake, it's just a trailer. The movie isn't even out yet. It's just a trailer. It's not that deep. It's not. Okay, it's not. Oh, 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 fucking moral of the movie. Oh, help me. Hold up. What does Cantonese people have to do with this? Huh? Are they the only race that bully other people? No. Assholes bully other people. It's not dependent on your race, you stupid fucking... <laughs> I'm fucking fuming right now. I don't even want to... I don't even want to add on to that. <laughs> this does look pretty good. It reminds me of myself, even though I'm not crazy. Wait a minute. What do you, what do you mean by that? Which part? A lot of the parts in the trailer was him being completely normal. He was functioning as a normal human being, like you and me. But near the end, there was a lot of scenes of him where he was dressed like a clown. So, 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 so are you telling me, are you trying to tell me right now that your life is a joke? The spiral of insanity can finally be witnessed. Smile while doing it. So you see, that's where the trouble began. That smile. That damn smile. <laughs> Are bye. This does put a smile on my face. Yes. I just witnessed three people who I'm assuming are not even on the same wavelength. Like, I'm not even sure they understood what each other meant. I used to think my life is a tragedy, but now I realize it's a comedy. What a trailer! Sums up my life. You are a joker then. It sums up everyone's life when they are at the very end of the rope. Everything seems so utterly bad and unsuccessful that it ends up making you laugh out of pointlessness. I have been there, in a mental state of total self-destruction and regardlessness for everyone and everything. Nothing seemed to work out well. So I laughed for everything. In the most inconvenient of times. I laughed when I was feeling bad. I laughed when someone else was feeling bad besides me. I laughed after I started crying. Being sick in the head really screws you up and it makes you even worse when you have family members, girlfriends, employers, Bitching in your ear on a daily basis, demanding pointless stuff for pointless reasons. It makes you want to kill them and kill yourself. 
But I came back through sheer force of will and dedication to positive stuff. No psychiatrist, no pointless money spent on sleep inducing medication. And I tell you, it is so difficult to stay up here. It is so damn difficult. It's a daily battle, but you must keep on going because it is the right thing to do, even if no one is watching. Yes! Yes! Woo! Yes! Woo! You know, dude, <sighs> it's been a really stressful day for me. You know, I've been fuming my ass off for the past few comments that I've been reading. It's been a really, really long day, but I'd like to take this time to thank you for sharing something that nobody ever asked for. Thanks. Thanks for that. Have you ever realized that this isn't a Dr. Phil video? Probably not, because his comments are disabled. The storyline is amazing. It shows you a different perspective of people we find weird or crazy or evil. No. <laughs> No, flat out no. This guy is straight up denying you. No, which is true. No, okay, no, just no. Shut the fuck up. No, stop ruining everything. The movie's not even out yet. Chill. Breach, my dude. Breach. Breach. Listen to me, okay? It's just a trailer, okay? It's not that deep. Stop fucking ruining the experience for everyone, okay? Please. Please. Please! Please! The worst part of having a mental illness is people expect you to behave as if you don't. Wow! When did he say this in the movie? You people ruin everything. Oh. Wow, indeed. 14 year old girls. You sure about that? By the looks of it, guys are starting to act more and more like girls each day. Oh. Damn, that's deep. Damn, boy. That's deep. Boy. You're a genius! <laughs> oh, I'm so fucking sad right now. I want to cry. I want to be called a genius. How do I get people to call me a genius? Do I just have to leave edgy, semi-depressing comments on every movie trailer? The standards for anything are getting lower and lower each day. The standards are so low that people like me are making YouTube videos. <laughs> oh God, got you. That's, that's, a, <laughs> that's a joke aimed to make myself depressed. You're welcome. That's, that's genius. That's actually a genius one right there. <laughs> make yourself depressed. You think you can make other people depressed? Whoa, hold up there, buddy. Focus on making yourself depressed. <laughs> now that's just sad. What's funny is if you follow the fathers of psychology, you'll find that the structure of a tragedy and a comedy are the same. The biggest difference is comedy expects you to smile at pain. Structure is something like protagonist lives in the status quo, encounters Shakov's gun, status quo changes, major life altering events, the protagonist evolves Shakov's gun faces the protagonist. The hero confronts the nature of his reality and either dies or further evolves. This is what we call the hero's journey, or more commonly known in comedies as the punchline. A lot of thought and effort went into that post, so I gotta take the time again to thank the guy for another unnecessary comment, but this time it's an unnecessary breakdown of comedy that nobody asked for. Thanks again, dude. Thanks. Used to be a non-believer, but now I believe. Believe in what, dude? Believe in what? What do you believe? What do you believe? Believe in what? In what? The past tense of you is not needing a D? 
Is that what you believe in? Huh? Now do you understand what I'm trying to say? You know, the funny thing is, the same thing happened last year. You remember Suicide Squad? With that fucking Harley Quinn and Joker? You remember that? Oh, God. No. No. Oh. I'm not bipolar. I'm multipolar. That means I cry and laugh while I beat the shit out of you. Love it. Hashtag Harley Quinn. Hashtag Margot Robbie. Even though we disagree at times, we are made for each other. And we'll fight for our bond till the end. I love you, puddin. Hashtag daddy. You want that shit? Huh? Who made this? Who fucking made this? How old are you? How old? <laughs> Sweetie, really just go outside, okay? Have some fresh air. You now take in the nature. Breathe it in. You know? Step away from the gadgets for a bit. You know, maybe for 25 years. Minimum. Alright, now that we've reached the end, do I think that people ruin everything? Yes! Yes, absolutely. Yes. Fuck. Yes. People ruin everything. Every fucking thing. You can't enjoy anything because of people. Do I hate them for it? Of course not. I enjoy making fun of people who are just as shitty as me. <laughs> I love the trailer, okay? I'm, I don't hate the trailer. I don't hate the movie. I love the trailer. That's why I'm like this. And I know people will still ruin everything. And I also know for a fact that I will be there for that. Part 2 on the way baby when the movie comes out or when they release a new trailer. Thanks for watching. Anyways guys, thanks for watching again. You gotta go cool off. Smile. Okay? Be happy. I just made your day. I'm not able to find words for trailer, just I have feelings. Hashtag respect. My man Pavan.